basically set up pilot projects for uh, 25 yeah. cities uh, around the country where the, the city could determine uh, what is best for the city as far as Section, uh, eight. Section 8 housing and HUD goes. And uh, I've probably received over the last two years six, seven hundred phone calls and messages about Section 8 housing. And <coughs> my personal stance is I'm for Section 8 housing. Uh, but I am for Dubuque controlling its program and having it not be controlled by bureaucrats in Washington, D.C. And I liked what our city council tried to do four years ago, which was say Dubuque should come first as far as Section 8, then county residents second, state of Iowa uh, residents third, and if there's any re uh, vouchers left over, people from out of state. That was what our own city council wanted to do, and I thought it was a good idea personally. Then HUD overruled them. And uh, so Leader McCarthy here has a bill that would uh, set up pilot projects and let, let cities and towns control their own destiny and uh, customize the HUD uh, funds to, to the, what's going to be best for their, their city. And I'll let, uh, is it a potential pilot city or is it just... Well, how it would work is every year there would be 25 new cities. So you'd have to apply. So we wouldn't earmark where it is. But when you look at what's going on here, I would think this would be one of the top cities in the country that would be able to apply and be able to have their own control. But they can also live off and look at the other ones that have been so successful. I mean, don't we want to help somebody to be able to move up? So you're going to move up their income. You're going to help them when it comes to education or training. And at the same time, it's going to build a stronger community. Um, it's going to solve some of those other problems that you see. And I think you'd have your own say in destiny. And that's what everybody wants. The closer government is to the people, the more transparency, the more efficiency, and the more accountability is brought to it. And that is what Dubuque is looking for. That is what the congressman has been working for. That's what he's been talking to me about. That's why I wanted to make sure I was able to come here and listen.